cover from the wintergreen family, checkerberry, teaberry. This is generally a fairly quiet time of day. Most wildlife activity is at the boundaries of day and night, dusk and dawn, by noon everything's settling in for its day. and the hemlocks. More insightful glimpse of the inlet. Vista a view is that the trail's mission to lead us to the view that we may contemplate the glory before us. Might just be a really large dog since I can't imagine a bear bothering to follow a human nature trail very far. Maybe the T 
congenial in their potential usages. Ah, yes, this would be our viewpoint. I should think. Yeah, that would be the broader mouth of the Bellamy. There's a great bay down there somewhere. The roar of the Spalding and this cute little inlet. All parts of the New Hampshire Audubon Bellamy River Wildlife Sanctuary. Got a little breeze coming in. See some woodpecker boring activity. Let's see where this yellow loop thing goes. It's kind of like a system I've seen in Duxbury. I think yellow means in the mean ones. Somewhere there's got to be an explanation of it all. Moss modeling along here, lichen. Mosses and lichens, the predominant elements of green color with the more subdued tones of the conifers. That's what you find this time of year. Like a podia putting in a, an appearance. Huh. Interesting current action out there. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
not really old. Fallen tree pillows. Maybe from the 60s or 70s. And here we have another Vista point. Yeah, this looks towards the mouth and uh, the bridge that carries Route 4. This is the wide end of the Bellamy River. 